stillness really does speak and it's been speaking to me in a life that is so filled with busyness and stress this past weekend after running my boulder boulder the 10k whenever i go out in nature and i'm able to exercise after that time i'm able to settle in and be quiet and so i picked up the book stillness speaks by Eckhart Tolle, and i read it yesterday and there was a section on nature and how one can use nature really to still the mind and it is a resource that we always have available to us and yet we easily forget about it i'm dr kelly martin Chu, amazon best-selling author speaker and transformational coach for women and i really want to speak about how nature can really point towards that stillness that we all desire in fact this morning after meditating i uh, was writing in my journal and i was looking outside and it's a beautiful sunny day in boulder and it had rained really hard last night and on our porch we have uh, chairs and cushions and there was water and dew on the cushions and with the sun the high colorado sun beating down the droplets of water were being transformed into steam and so steam was rising there was also steam right above the fence line uh, from an awning from my neighbor's awning and so as i looked outside it almost looked like smoke as this water in an instant turned to steam and so whatever it is that you're going through you can turn even towards a flower here's a flower that my daughter brought to me last week and i have to admit my impatient mind is going when will it bloom will when will it open it'll open in its own timing so i encourage you today to find that stillness inside especially if things are challenging things will always change and we don't need to be impatient we can experience the now now and in this moment change is happening and when will your life change it's changing right now and whether you're holding on to something good because it's so good and you're fearful that it won't last or things are challenging and you're waiting for that time to pass remember the droplet of water transforming in an instant into steam we're constantly changing and i encourage you this week to turn to nature to find the stillness to gaze at a flower to let the sun hit your face to bask in the now signing off have a fantastic week